Hello, this is Blue Leader, and we're here in Big Bear, California, where they have six superchargers. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. Let me give you my initial impressions of the supercharger and surrounding area. Initial thoughts. First thought, you're in Big Bear. There are six superchargers, so be careful navigating in and out of the parking lot. It can get packed, and if you have to wait, move over a little bit to the side so people can go around you. Initial feelings. Uh, I've got a feeling of excitement because you guys, the Tesla drivers, voted on getting a supercharger here in Big Bear. So when you come all the way up, you can charge here. Initial concerns, not too concerned, but like I said, be very careful during the winter time so you're not slipping and sliding in the parking lot and on the road to Big Bear. Beautiful, beautiful area. Now, I'd like to thank you guys for showing that support. So please continue to do so by hitting the like and the subscribe. And if you know anyone that wants to hang with us, make sure you share the content over with them. Thank you so much and hang tight for the guest review. when they brought this out but it's only been I think recent and we're by a coffee shop over here with six charging stations in my cyber truck in the front and these are my two little girls the ones that make me laugh this coffee place over here I've been having so this is my second day here I came yesterday too I've been having this honey bee latte cinnamon latte it's amazing their banana bread is also great if you go a little bit further out this place called Tropicali it has poke and it's amazing, one of the best pokés I've had. Now I'm wondering, is there anything else a person can do while they supercharge here? I guess depending on what time of year you come, you could go snowboarding and then uh, come back and pick up your car. This time of year they have some mountain biking, maybe some other hikes, but yeah. Do you travel in your Cybertruck a lot? We have traveled in it a little bit and we're planning on doing a lot more traveling in it. It's very convenient. What's the furthest road trip you've taken in your Cybertruck? From Big Los Bear. Angeles to Big Bear. It's about two and a half hours. Did you have to charge between LA to Big Bear? No, I didn't. I didn't. I charged when I got here. If your Cybertruck battery runs out, would you pay to replace it? It really depends. It depends on how long into the future that is and how much Cybertrucks are at that point in time because I think I'm probably going to get another Cybertruck if I don't replace the battery. So, uh, yeah. Very cool, Josh. Now, before we take off, do you have any final words of wisdom for us? Yeah, get a Cybertruck and invest in Tesla stock because Elon is not messing around here with these cars. Great advice. We'll see you later. Bye, everybody. Thank you. Bye-bye. Say bye, guys. Perfect. Josh, what makes you laugh? Um, my kids. What about your kids make you laugh? They say some really funny things. They have no filter. <laughs>